Ladies and gentlemen, the horses are on the track and prettying post road. Race number two this evening's first division for two-year-old affiliate trotters in the fourth leg of Ohio Sires. Racing one mile, a purse of $19,300. There are no changes. Here's the lineup, the one Ashwood Anya. Here's a bay daughter of Carrie the Message over the Ashwood Farms of Brexville, Ohio. Marty Woolham, the uh, trainer, with a mark of 206 and 3 at Urbana. Earnings of $5,000 just off that win. She draws the rail tonight. Marty Woolham driving Ashwood Anya. The two is a chestnut daughter of Tabor Lobel, owned by Charles Britsky of Pennsylvania. Jack Smith, the uh, trainer. Coming in from Northfield Park, Ohio, Sires making her eighth career start now. Earnings of $4,700. Jack Smith driving the two. Baby, you're the one. The three is a bay daughter of Overcomer, all by Max Graber and Raymond Creekmore of Ohio. Barbara Lewis, the uh, trainer, with a mark of 202. Several starts back at Northfield Park in Ohio Fair Sticks. Earnings of $11,500. From post three, it's Gin Queen and Russell Swartz. The four is a bay daughter of Mighty Crown, owned by HPS Consulting of Findlay. Ed Greeno Sr., the uh, trainer, with a mark of 206 at Lexington, earnings of $14,000. Informatica, it's the four, our Mighty Ten, with Ed Greeno Jr. The five is a uh, bay daughter of Ditto Hanover. Over Don McCurgan and uh, Bill Carter Jr. of Ohio. Don McCurgan, the uh, trainer, a mark of 204 and three at Northfield Park, $10,000 in earnings. Coming in from Northfield, it's Lizzie Brown and Don McCurgan. The six is a bay daughter of Mr. Kingfish, shown by Leroy Amos and Edward Thomas of Ohio. Edward Thomas, the uh, trainer, with a mark of 202 and 2 here at Sayuda Downs. Earnings of over $22,000. She's already four of six in her rookie season. It's Splash Mania with Dave Miller. The seven is a bay daughter of speed and action, owned by Edelbert Kemp of Archibald, Ohio. Tom Moore, the uh, trainer, with a mark of 211 at Paulding, earnings of $6,800. Coming in from Northfield, a park sire sticks, it's active Princess and Tom Moore, Jr. The eight horse, a bay daughter of Armbrough Yilliad, owned by James and Billy Crane of Middletown, Ohio. Billy Crane, the uh, trainer, she sports a, a mark of 201 and one fifth in the uh, Final of the Ohio State Fair Stakes. Two starts back here at Cider Downs. Already earnings of over $30,000. Chip Noble drives, HR's curious. Routing out the field to nine is a brown daughter of Lucky Elmerhurst. Oh, by Dean Davis of Wooster, Mike Epler, the uh, trainer. Making her fifth career start this evening. Earnings of over $7,000. It's date book with Jeff Fount. That's the field for the First Division two-year-old fillies. Win, play, show, perfecto, pick three wagering. Seven minutes until post time. They swing to the back stretch. There they go. And uh, they're off, and HR's curious from the outside. Stops away nicely here for the lead from mid-track. It's Lizzie Brown. Towards the inside of three comes our mighty uh, ten. From the inside, baby, you're the one. Angling in from the outside five, it's date book off the pylon sixth. Ashwood and Yard to the outside and seventh. Active Prince is the trailer is Jin Queen as they round the upper turn. HR's curious. An early four length advantage here. Lizzie Brown to the inside is trotting his second. On the rail three, baby, you're the one. At the first quarter, 29 seconds as they trot through the stretch. HR's curious with a lead here. A snug hole leads by four. Lizzie Brown on the inside is second. Baby, you're the one along the rail is third. Then it's another gap of three. Armani 10 fourth. Moving to the outside. First up, Ashwood Anya. Along the rail in sixth to date book. Then at seventh is Active Princess. And following a break at the quarter, the trailer is Gin Queen. They reach the half. And it's HR's Curious with Noble aboard. Leading here by a solid three. Half and 59 and three fifths. As they move off the turn and down the back stretch. And HR's Curious. A snappy opening half here with a lead. Now by two lengths. Lizzie Brown is closing steadily. Here comes Ashwood Anya to the outside, making her bid for the lead. She's now second to challenge the leader. And maybe you're the one in the pocket. A solid effort tonight is racing fourth and alongside the five to date book. Field begins to tighten up a bit now. It's HR's Curious with a lead. Still a length and a half, two. Three quarters, 130 and three. Lizzie Brown to the inside has yet to move off the rail second. And baby, you're the one. Has yet to leave the wood third. Has a turn for home now. Less than an eighth of a mile to go. And 
down the stretch they come. HR's Curious and McCurden coming with Lizzie Brown on the outside. In mid-stretch, it's Lizzie Brown, a 13 to one shot here, taking the lead away from HR's Curious. HR's Curious is tiring, it's Lizzie Brown at the wire. Consolation in the uh, Daily Double tonight, the 5-5, five, five, $89.40, $89.40, and the $565.40, $540. Ladies and gentlemen, here is the official winner of the first division, two of the Philly Trotters of the fourth leg of Ohio Sires. From post position number five, it's Lizzie Brown, a daughter of Ditto Hanover from Lud Mueller by Arnie's Exchange. Over Don McCurgan and uh, William Carter Jr. of Ohio. Don McCurgan, the uh, trainer and uh, driver, Lizzie Brown, recording her second career win in record time this evening. After finishing second in Ohio Sires at Northfield Park in the third leg, coming right back down to Cider Downs, taking her first win in Ohio Sires. It's Lizzie Brown in 202 and 3. One scratch, six two and five.